I'd like to say that you're in for a challenge, but for some reason I think that you don't see it that way at all when you look at the work that your partner has already done on the snow. Sure. I mean, no, no, it's definitely going to be a challenge, you know, definitely because, um, uh, you know, it's, it's like learning. I'm learning. You know, I'm learning what's, you know, the capability and what we, how we can we, you know, make this work. And um, But she has an amazing, uh, amazing spirit and amazing attitude. And, you know, she's really turned her disability into her ability. Or sorry, her, her you know, you, you know what I mean? Like her, her disadvantage into her advantage in the sense that, you know, it's really given her this drive to, to defy the odds. And uh, for me, I'm really uh, excited to be a part of that, that journey with her and uh, to go to the next level and, and to, to dance with her, you know. And I think it's, it's going to be really special. But then there's a great twist this season, or a not-so-great twist, depending on how you look at it. You work with her, you work with her, you work with her, and then someone else takes her over. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. In any other season, I would, you know, it would be kind of fun. You know, I think, but I think with her, I, 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 would, be, I would be a little protective because, you know, it's gonna take, it takes a while. So, you know, it's going to be very interesting way to um, understand, you know, I mean, uh, the weight, the balance, and all those different things like that. So, but I, honestly, I, I like the, I like I like the twist. I like the twist. I think, I think it's cool. I think I, I've actually suggested it seasons ago, like a long time ago, just because I thought it'd be kind of fun. Just see what happens, and it might be a train wreck, but either way, it'll be entertaining to watch. Um, so, so we'll see. We'll see how it goes. But now, to be careful what you wish for, right? No, absolutely, absolutely. So we'll see. We'll see what happens. Okay. So, what's the one thing? Last question. You can tell me for sure. You know about your partner. I mean, one thing I know about Amy is that she has a comparable spirit, you know, and, and really, she's just she's just about to find the odds. You know, she, she, she told me, uh, you know, when she woke up out of her coma and she lost both her legs, and you know, she made two decisions. One was that she wasn't going to feel sorry for herself, and two that you know she was going to snowboard within the year, and she did. Within seven months, she was on the snow again. And for somebody who was in left, she had less than two percent chance of living. And uh, you know, lost her hair in her left ear, lost her kidneys, you know, transplants. Basically, put she calls herself Fembot. She was put back together. And uh, but to see what she's achieved is pretty amazing. It's incredible. Go talk to someone else. Nice to see you. You too. I said to somebody else. Some people walked out like they've been already rehearsing for weeks, just knowing how to move. You you've been ready to do this for a while, haven't you? I'm so excited to be here at Canada Center. I've been a fan of the show forever, and we've had four days of rehearsal, pretty intense rehearsal. I can't lift my legs. Like, I couldn't put my pants on this morning. So I mean, so, so hard. Well, he's got this kind of smooth, suave, sophisticated manner of teaching, yeah. and you're... Yeah. Does it work? I think so. I hope so. Yeah, I talk fast. He talks slowly. But we understand each other. So that's good. Yeah, I know, I know. I'm so excited. I've got this very high energy. Maybe I'll calm down. We think maybe that we'll rub off on each other so that, you know, I can energize him. Not that he needs it, but if he can calm me down, which I do need. So. You always have something in the back of your mind about what this competition is about and the personal victories that you provide to your partners. So what are you already thinking about when it involves Danica? I mean, you know, I, I want to celebrate her, celebrate, you know, empower her, give her confidence. Her, I mean, she doesn't need it. Uh, she's, she's quite confident and, and, and very much in control. But I feel like she's so clever, so on top of everything. You know, I want her to be able to let go a little bit, let go of the control and, and just let somebody else take care of her for a little bit. I'm, uh... I keep really good statistics on this show. You're the first celebrity who's going to make me nervous about my statistical skills. <laughs> no, 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 I'm not like that. Um, no, you know your numbers. I know my numbers, but I, but I love you guys. I mean, it's all good. <laughs> uh, what it, does the ability of numbers does that somehow translate to the musicality? Just because she. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. I can count to eight again and again, and he can do that. That's, well, he said that's the extent of his math ability. That he can count to eight, but that's start. Again. You see, look, you see the energy, and you see the willingness, and you see the, the urge to go dance. What is that like for you? To, you know, sometimes partners are a little reserved, a little argumentative. She's ready to go for it. No, it's, just, it's incredibly inspiring. It's, it's very motivating for me to show up and, and, and brainstorm and want to want to think of something amazing because you know when you have that kind of you know dedication you want to you want to reciprocate it it really creates a certain responsibility so in four days she's already thinking of you you need to create 
something amazing. Yeah. Yeah, she's awesome. I mean, no, listen, this is really early in the morning, and I'm very tired, but I am extremely excited to have that. She's awesome, and, you know, we've, we've known each other for four days, and, and we're ready. It seems like a